so I'm about to commence my shooting in the desert. I just used my cold steel machete bat looking thing to clear that little section of bush out. I cut all that part of the bush out and then I threw the branches into the bush back there so it makes more shade. There were little tufts of grass here but I chopped them. Chop them at the roots like this. They won't be going back. I think they get the message. Oh. I wanted to show off my GoPro rig. <clears throat> this is sitting on my Marlin XT22 22 LR rifle. It's got the heavy 21 inch barrel. I did the custom free float work myself. Heavy barrel, free floated stock. Nothing's gonna touch it. Anyway, I bought this scope mount from eBay for three bucks. This right here, which you see on top of my scope. It's pretty much a ring with a section of Picatinny rail on top of it so you can attach like a laser or a red dot, whatever you want. But I had the bright idea of getting this and drilling a 3 16th hole from the top through to the bottom and then getting quarter inch by 20 uh, die, tap and die, and actually threading the hole. Then what I did is I got a bolt from the hardware store, again quarter inch by 20, and I screwed it into the mount itself. So if you were to take this aluminum GoPro holder off, you would see a section of just bolt sticking up out of it. I had the ingenious idea of taking this aluminum GoPro mount and forcibly screwing it so it faces that way, true up and down north and south on this mount. So making this rock solid, there is no movement at all in this, only up and down. But I'm in control of that with the tension on the back. As you can see, it faces directly out that way, down the barrel. I would show you how it works, but it's a GoPro Hero session. It's the number five, so there's no screen on the back. You're just gonna have to see the, the footage once I upload it. It's gonna be pretty cool. But as you can see, whatever I'm looking down at the barrel, the GoPro can see as well. So if I see I'm gonna hit that green bottle over there, you'll be able to see it. If I see I'm gonna take out those orange specks of clays that are left on the mountain over there, You'll see that too. This is pretty awesome. I haven't seen anybody else think of something like this. I kind of want to market it, but seeing as how I just put it on YouTube, it's kind of fino. Maybe somebody will make it, wink, wink, and I can buy copies of it without having to work so hard. <clears throat> but yeah, there it is. You can take it off with uh, Allen wrench and um, just has four bolts. Also, it comes with uh, inserts for one inch screws for one inch tubes on the scopes. This is actually a 30 millimeter. It's bigger than one inch so I can get more light and uh, I can see better. I like it a lot. I'll be using it here in a little bit, but for now, I'm gonna use my AK because I got a brand new muzzle device for that and I wanted to show it off. Thanks for watching.